We had a little me mechanical problem with this incredible reel. I, 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 I like pressing cards. Yeah. You like to. <laughs> <laughs> I like pressing too many, I think. Boy. What did he ate before? Oh, dude, that's a, that's a fish. That's a fish. That's a fish. That's a fish. <laughs> what they do, they store fat over here. You know what I can tell you? Yeah. That's delicious. Delicious. Mm. Oh, yeah. Hey, guys. We got golden tile on right now. Guys, this video is going to be sick. Ricky. So what's up? Dude, one. Ricky's gonna show me how to catch some tile fish, guys. We got one coming up, and the rod's bent, and he's pounding. pounding. He's pounding, bro. He's pounding. He's amazing. Guys, stay tuned to oh this video. God, yeah, 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 yeah. Here we go. Oh <laughs> Golden tile fish. Here we go, baby. Watch your lip. All right, let me show you real quick. Que tenemos? <laughs> okay, this is gonna be, I don't even know how this is called, to be honest. <laughs> to me, it looks like a big L. <laughs> it's an L thing. An L thing. <laughs> And again, I'm not even sure if it's supposed to be hooked here on this side. This is how I do it. I'm gonna show you guys how I do it. And it's been working for me great. And you see, uh, I got my sinker on this side, which should be on this side. Whatever yep. way you use it, the sinker hole is gonna go be here. Okay. It's gonna be here. I use a clamp, uh, one of these things, how do you call this? Uh, snap swivel. A snap swivel, Stan, thank you so much. It's got my angle, a little bit. I would say four feet, five feet. Uh, fluorocarbon, this is 60 pounds only, 82 like. It's gonna be a five-wall circle hook right here. That's it. Your main line goes here. That's it. And that's, that's how it works. When the fish bites, they go like this. You're gonna feel on top. You're that's real. it. You're real, that's it. Look at that, look at that. I've got that. My ta I don't have this in my tackle, but I've got that in my tackle. <laughs> <laughs> I've so, got the hook. This is how you do it. Just a simple reel, uh, simple knot. I don't go crazy on knots. Yep. Just do a simple, improve clinch. Oh yeah, a tornado. Improved clinch. Knot. Improved clinch knot. You go back. You go back in. You go back. It's going through. Got it. Where? Go. Yeah. But this, you, is, this is really simple. Yeah. And it hasn't fell for me. So. Hey, you gotta watch your lip too. You threw oh, that. Yeah. You threw that hook up there real quick there, <laughs> you man. You gotta watch my lip. Watch your lip. <laughs> this setup is ready to go. Down. That's ready to go. Yep. And we so just need a bait. We got a bait. bait. And what are we using for bait today, Ricky? Oh, we're gonna use speedos. Speedos. And, uh, speedos and goggle eyes. Speedos and goggle eyes. All right. You catch these? Yes. Okay, so. Look at the speedos, bro. Look at that, baby. I know people that eat these things. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I have friends that when they when they find a spot, this speedo, they go like, oh, dinner. That's dinner. <laughs> that, that, so that's it for them. They're they're happy Look with this, that. Bro. Look at this. This is a big speedo. There's yeah, some meat on that. Actually, let me tell you, they taste good. Do they? I did a ceviche with one. There is some ceviche. Yeah, really? It worked really well. Okay. Let me put them on the on the on the light well because they're frozen. A little bit frozen. So, and Ricky, you got the electric on there, huh? Yeah. And so there there is no tile fishing without electric. Uh, is we are in about <laughs> 750. Yeah, 750. Yeah. We're going to go deeper. We're going to go deeper, We're right? Go deeper, yeah. yeah. I was. I don't know if I could do electric on my skiff. <laughs> yeah, I did it on my kayak. On the kayak? Yeah, on my kayak, yeah. What, I with mean, the... Not with this oh. one, with that reel, the other one, this one. Really? Yeah. Electric Ooh. on the kayak? Ah, show you my video. Really? I got my videos on the FL Fishing Channel. Okay. I don't post it there anymore, but I got those videos there. People used to think they say that I was crazy, but I'm not really, bro. Kayaks are safe. They are. If you have the right kayak. Yeah. In the right condition. This yeah. is not bad at all. No, this we can... Nothing. Eight foot swells is okay for a kayak. A little tip for the kayakers. If you don't see the white, uh, the white stuff on, on top of the wave, on top of the swell, you're good. Okay. As long as like this. As I'm long as you don't see white on the top. It's called the white caps. When you yep. see white caps, yep. oh, get run. <laughs> or getting too windy. Get Got it. it. So it's spe yeah. speedo time. Speedo. Are we doing? We're gonna get a you're just going to fillet him. Yeah. That's it. That's it. He still might be a little bit, a uh, little frozen. It is frozen. <laughs> yeah. He's, he's, he didn't thaw too much. You know, but I don't want to wait. I no. just want to... Fish. One, one filet? Yeah, one Man, this is simple. It is. If, if you have that set up, this is simple. Yeah. But the hard part is finding the spot. Yes. It's a big ocean. It's pretty empty out there. Yes. You will go places and drop and nothing, drop and nothing, drop and nothing. Then boom, you're down there. You gotta go. You find a good spot. Got it. Save it and look. Let's move to a good spot real quick. Okay. Okay, Ricky. Take it down, boy. One, two, go. 
That's it. You just, what are you doing? Just pressing a button and it drops, huh? I just the clutch, just put it all the way down. It's free spool. Oh, it's for, it says in free spool. Yeah. And that's dropping down all the way down. 800 feet. Oh, yep. 750. 750. Talk to me about tile fish, Ricky. So they're, they're on the bottom. They live in the mud, I hear. They live in the mud. And, and they, they make like holes. And they don't get, they don't go too far away from the hole. Okay. And when they, they live. So it's kind of like a grouper, but not in rock. Exactly. And so you're not worried about getting hung up on rocks out here? Not at all. You will actually hang up on the, on the, on the mud. On the mud. It sinks it in? Hard, it will sink in hard. Then it pull it hard and then start drifting. Really? Yeah. If it doesn't get so, it. so the weight will just sink down into the mud. Yeah, if it doesn't, you're not in the right spot. Really? Yep. Okay. Yes, sir. That's how you tell you in the right spot. You want you want your mud going. If you find a spot that has mud in the right dip, you get tired. Yeah, Lorenzo, this is our mud. This is the saltwater mud fish right here. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we have mud fish in our canal, if you are but I don't know. I wouldn't need it. 380 to 400 feet, 500 feet at most, you get great tidal fish. Okay. So if they have in that area has it, you can get them. But for golden, you have to be... The goldens are deeper. Golden, you buy it past. My experience, you gotta, you want to be out at 60. Okay. And then, and it's one per person. One per person. And what's the size limit? No size. No size. So whatever break, whatever comes up, you're ready at the bottom. We're at the bottom. So what I do so when, I, when I hit the bottom, I let it be for a little while. Yeah. So you want it to go into the mud? No, really. I just or, want to have a little slack. A little slack. Because when I close it, I want the rod to bring the rod, or the, 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 the sinker all the way up to so it. fast. I want to give them a minute. That way they can smell it. Yeah. We'll come for it. If they aim it around, aim it around. Anything around. So I'm going to lock it now. Okay, he's locked now. I want to make sure it's not insane amount of the drag because I don't want to break the lip. No. I do not get to wash Watch your lip. lip, but don't break it. <laughs> exactly. So right now, all we have to do is wash the rod tip. It should go like. Dum, dum, dum. Right now, it's stuck on bottom. You see how it's not moving? Yeah. When it goes up, it will be like. Ugh. So we're just waiting for a rod. We're just watching the rod tip. Yeah. Yeah. Last time that I was here, my friend was the one that noticed it. Because I was catching another one, the other rod. Yeah. My friend told me, oh, something was playing with it. I said, you sure, bro? That fast? I don't think so. And when we brought it up, it had a fish. It had a fish. Yeah. And it is a little rough. It's today, a little so bumpy today, guys. It is a little bumpy. That's why it is not ideal for this. Because you wanted to be able to see everything. See, I'm gonna lock it a little bit. Yeah. Right now, bro, I'm gonna set up the rod. Yeah. This thing, it's a little monster. Little monster. And what pound test you got on there? I got 60. 60? Mm-hmm. That's 60 braid. What about on that one? That's 80. 80. That's like floral? Or no, that's oh, braid, braid. braid. Oh, it is braid. That's braid because that's how that's how a real for sword. Swordfish. So okay, so you go sword fishing with that bad boy. Yeah. Got it. Well, you can do anything. Yeah. This is, you can this, do anything. What we're doing now, that is, I like that. That little reel, oh my God. For this one, that one's already, it's a little fast. Got See, it. My, my bait is already out of the water. It's getting higher. So what you have to do, and you should do, Yeah. Gotta put it, down. it's got to be on bottom. Okay. Is it going sideways? No, nah, it's a little, nah, it wasn't too high. You see, that's perfect. When, okay. when, when it goes down, it only goes like a little bit. Yeah. Because we remember we have an L shape, a, a piece of line, so the line will be dangling behind. For them, for them to okay. Reach. So yeah, there's slack there. So he's on no, bottom. No, but it's, uh, exactly. So it didn't really go like uh, down for a long time. It just went down like boom, like three feet. Yeah. Maybe not even three feet. This so, thing. So this is also for for gold, gold. anything, or golden grouper. So uh, we can get grouper here? Oh, yeah. If it's rocks around, any couple of rocks around here, we get them, yeah. Okay. You, get, you get snowy, you get golden, uh, right. golden edge, you get a lot of different ones. Oh, man. Right there. But, but the grouper hang on in rocks, though, right? Exactly. It, and if you're in rocks, then you're not necessarily in the right place for tiles. Right. Okay. You are not. You mostly will catch uh, roses and stuff like that. So you're just clipping your little guppy rig there with your... I'm gonna use a smaller sinker. That way, it stays away from the other one. Okay. This one's gonna be three uh, pounds. So it's gonna flip, It's gonna drift out a little bit more. A little bit more. So, so we don't so get tangled. Now, when we get to the spot, what we do? We drop this one first. It stays away from this one. This one over here. We don't want to be. Yeah, yeah, so it's yeah. It's gonna be like this. You see, one away from the other. Yep, that makes sense. Just a simple cut. That's now, it. Now it's way easier. Yeah, it's uh, fought out a little frozen, bit more. Not that bad. I could, I can do it. So that's a that's a 
golden tile fish ceviche right there, huh? Yeah. <laughs> so what I want to do now, make some cuts. We got three baits. Okay. Oh my God, this yeah, is so buddy. yummy. Yummy. Then, yeah. Ricky, don't resist the urge, bro. Don't, don't eat it, man. <laughs> I won't. We need to bathe. <laughs> oh my God, we're going to watch this. Wait till we get to the spot now. Okay. Um, <laughs> <laughs> okay, I like it. All right, what we're gonna do here? We're gonna have a smaller sinker and three baits. Okay, three baits, smaller sinker. That way, stays away from the uh, from the other one. Yep, and a little right. beast. If he goes down. You want me to do that? No. Are right, just good? I have it set up. You know, you can uh, ball bearing. You always adjust it right here. Sorry, you adjust it right here. It's now it's not too soft, too yep. loose. It will. It should go like this. Yeah. Nice and smooth. All right, so it's got the meat. The the how many feet down the gauge there okay. so so this is just sitting on bottom is that okay because it's going slack and then coming up yeah we should let it go a little bit more let it go more the, the let me show you how to do it no. yeah what we do the right way to do you pull a little bit back it will be soft okay if it's not you will fight it oh yeah yeah it's a little trick for that's daiwa oh daiwa real those uh any daiwa real small like that oh, those small daiwa real that's the way you should do it okay what I do, I let go a lot of line, lock it, and hold. I hold it like this. Oh, he's biting! He's biting! Bite. Yeah. Oh, we're getting a fish. We're getting a fish. We got a fish. Getting... That was quick. Okay, guys, we definitely have a fish on this one, guys. I saw the rod tapping. Oh, look at, look at. Yeah, he's tapping. Let's see if I can get that. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right, come on, tile fish. I want to see what's going on here, guys. <laughs> Yeah, he's not so big. We don't need power. We want, we want to keep, we want, we want to keep that hook oh. at all times. You see that rod? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bend. Yeah, not, yeah. Not too bad, but you want to have that rod bend. Okay. We put it loose. I hope not. There you go. Hey, oh boy, yeah. Look, look. He's tapping, bro. Oh, yeah. Heck yeah. Ricky, come on, baby. Go. Here we go. Come on. Thirty feet. Thirty feet. He's almost here. Look at that, yeah, Woo! baby. Come on. Yes, 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 That's yes, yes. Nice Heck yeah, bro. Look, look at that bad boy. Whatever he ate before. Oh, dude, that's a that's a fish. That's a fish. We don't know what it is. We just a fish. We don't know what it is. What the heck is that, bro? It's spitting. Golden tile fish, bro. It looks like a different, like a no. Check tile. it. It know. might be a little tile. It's not a golden tile. It looks like a different. I don't know what it is. Oh, yeah, it's, it's got. Like, yeah. All right, <laughs> bro. What do we got here, man? This is our first golden today. So tell me about this fish, man. Talk to me about it. Check this out. Look at that guy. What they do? They store fat over here. Okay. This one has a really tiny crest. Okay. But sometimes they have big ones full of fat. Okay. And Beautiful fish, man. Something else that I can tell you? Yeah. They're delicious. Delicious. Ooh. I don't eat a lot of fish, and yeah. this fish I eat. That's the one you go. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. That's why I love this so much. Hey. Perfect. Perfect. And they won't be very uh, sh uh, picky. Whatever, no. Whenever they see bait, they're going to eat it. They're going to eat it. So I got a whole fish. No. Okie dokie, we're going back down, guys. Guys, here we go. We just got this heavy mono leader deal with the little squid looking thing and a chunk of uh, Speedo, three hook rig, and we're going down. Okay. All right, we're on bottom, guys. Finally hit bottom. Yep, 720. 
five, 730 feet. And so Ricky says, when, when the weight hits the bottom, it'll sink into the mud. So you give it a, once it hits bottom, you give it a little slack and just kind of let it settle into the mud. And then after a few minutes, Dude, I think we're getting hit again. I think it's I think it's getting hit. Is that okay? What do we do here? How do we? It sounds like that. You got a fish. It's a fish already. Yeah. He's bouncing. I didn't even throw the other one. I did it all by myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh my! All God. by myself. Golden tile. All by myself. All right, guys. Here we go. Sometimes when they are, when they, this, this just hook them, they don't, they, they don't fight much. Once they start seeing the light, they go crazy. Okay, so he. Yeah. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. So when we do, uh, do we release small ones? No, we can. They will die. They will die. Got it. I would kill a fish just to get small one. What a guy, man. What a guy. That's good. That's good. I don't do it. I do this because I love it, not because I'm hungry. You know that's right. I mean? That's I, right. One fish, even if it's two pounds, it's enough for me and my family. That's right. Okay, guys. Towel fish coming in. Yeah, I got more than that. Okay, we got fish, guys. We got fish. Oh, my God. oh yeah, he's decent. He's nice. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Look at that thing, man. Oh, that's a nice fish. Heck Let yeah. I thought it was going to be like a two-pounder or something like that. But like, he's an eater. Something. Dude. Dude. Look at this. Look at that thing, man. That's a nice fish. That's oh, I'll take this all day long. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't want a kingfish. Trust me. I'd rather catch these even smaller than any that are 40 pounds of kingfish. <laughs> all day. Look at that. Look at that thing, man. <laughs> so Golden beautiful. tile fish, guys. Look at that bad oh. boy. All right. So we, we actually have our limit. Yep, we're gonna, we got to go way deeper now to look for rosies. Rosies. Oh, look at you. No, 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 no. Should have watched your lip, buddy. He's got some <laughs> teeth, so I'm not going to get my fingers too deep in there. Yeah. Look at that. He's got some teeth. He can do some damage. Here we go, guys. Oh, my God. We got our limit, just like that. Golden tile fish. Um, I can't wait to eat this, Ricky. I hear these things are amazing. Amazing. Bro, I love them, bro. I love them. Amazing. I, I, I don't know anybody that doesn't like them. Come on, man. Look at this thing. So, uh, Rick, you told me mm -hmm. that these count as a grouper. Is that correct? Exactly. So if you if you catch these guys and then you go catch grouper, you can only catch two. In my side here, South Florida, my Atlantic, yeah. South Florida, yeah. we allow to catch three groupers, right? Okay, in our right? area, yeah. Okay, in good. our area, right now they're close. Most of the thing I'm close right now, groupers, anyway. Yeah. But anyway, we, any time of the year you catch one of those guys, yeah. you you already took one and spot from the group show me this little thing on the this little lump on the head this yeah what is that thing it's uh that's where they like storage the grease the store some fat so fat exactly yep. so like maybe when it gets cold and exactly. there's not much food they can eat they, that they thing. eat that stuff exactly Jeez, like a, like a peacock like bass. a camel like a peacock a, a peacock bass do the peacock same thing bass, they, they, that's what they do guys golden tile fish i guess we're gonna go for rosies right now but mission accomplished man that's what we wanted today. Bro, give me an elbow. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Ricky. You Guys, make sure welcome, you brother. subscribe to Tecnicas de Pesca y Mas. Perfect. Did Tecnica, I say it right? Yeah, Tecnicas de Pesca y Mas. Oh yeah. my God, I'm working on my- Dude, um, your Spanish acento, is great. Acento de Cubano. <laughs> it's but, great, bro. Um, uh, you know, I'm trying, but Ricky's an amazing guy. He's a gentleman, he's a scholar. Thank and you, hold on, here, Appreciate here, it, bro. turn that camera around. Bro. He's a gentleman, he's a scholar. And he's a, he's a great guy to fish with, and he's a teacher. I appreciate it, This brother. guy's a teacher. He's got all kinds of tackle for sale. <laughs> Guys, check out his channel. The link is in the description, right, Mr. Golden Tile? Yeah. <laughs> Should've watched your lip, boy. Watch your lip, guys. All right, guys.